In this video, we play Russia's premium bias BT-7, The Terror of the Dark Forest, the Baba Yaga. You know, one thing I like about the BT-7 and BT-5, it can get you out of trouble quick. But more importantly, it can get you into trouble quick. Shh. No one's here. I said no one's here. No one's here, dude. Your existence is safe. Nothing bad will happen. Everything's okay. Nope. No one here. Peekaboo. Oh. Shh. Sleep now. Mister is like, I know he's around here somewhere. I'll find you, little BT. I'm gonna get you, he's saying. He's like, I'm sneaking up behind him right now. There's no way he's gonna kill me again. Oh. <laughs> Sleep now. That's it. Go to sleep, little baby. It's okay. Hush now. Oh. <laughs> I think we made someone angry. This is not good. Drive! <laughs> Are we getting away with this? Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> yeah, wait for me. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, what's up, dude? Whoa. This is fine. <laughs> what's going on, dude? Oh. Oh god. <laughs> Of course, the summer moment. <laughs> Hi guys, and welcome back to the channel. And if you enjoyed that little intro, please make sure to hit the like button. We've got more of that type of gameplay to come. Uh, but first off, this is the BT-7A F32. Now, this little guy here was available as a event vehicle for Operation Heat in 2019, which is actually quite a long time ago now, over two years. Uh, and if you missed it, I'm afraid to say this thing is pretty expensive now on the marketplace. There is a whopping 55, uh, probably about 100 vouchers left, I would say, and it's now $32.45 right now if you want to pick one up. Uh, you can get one cheaper, but you might wait a while, and I'm betting by the end of this video, uh, they're going to end up skyrocketing in price. So what this thing essentially is, is a BT-7, which is a very mobile platform that actually gets scouting unlike any other BT series tank in the game. And it's also got the F-32 cannon, very similar cannon to what's on the T-34 series. And with its best shell here for penetration is 86 millimeters. That means you could side shot Panthers, Tigers, uh, you can do a lot of damage with this little thing. Of course, its reload speed isn't as good as the BT-5s, obviously with a larger cannon, a lot more of a cramped turret. Uh, there's three dudes inside as per usual. Uh, but the fact that it gets scouting and that you can take on Panzer IVs and stuff head on, really, this thing is an awesome little machine. Now, there are a few downsides to this vehicle, one of which is it has track lock, which is a really weird steering system. It's quite difficult to control if you don't get to grips with it. Uh, the turret rotation speed is only 15 degrees a second, but that shouldn't really matter as long as you master the mobility of this thing. And of course, uh, as usual with any BT series, it can be 50 cal or even MG'd from the front. The turret is actually the weakest point uh, where the two crew members that are the most vulnerable sit. It, it's very easy to kill. You'll die to artillery a lot too. Planes will target you as well. Uh, so survivability isn't its greatest trait. Now, like many of you are, are doing the tasks for your Operation Winter. Uh, I've got three very powerful event vehicles up here. The ITP M1 I'm using as cast plane, and of course the mighty Tizma. This thing cost like $10 at one point. It's now almost 100 so you can imagine what this thing is going to go like eventually. Uh, this thing is absolutely awesome. I've got some very, very good games lined up for you guys. Uh, quick fire as well. It should be a lot of fun. Hope you guys enjoy this video. All right, Stalingrad is a pretty fitting map. Oh, it's a Goliath, mate. Wait, I, I've seen this guy's name before. I think we are facing Germany, by the way. I haven't checked yet. Oh, you're China as well and Italy. And check our BR. We kind of upped here on this thing quite a bit just so we can play the Tasman ITP. 
which I don't really see a problem in. It's a chaffy, it's going to get him scouted up. We're definitely going to be scouted ourselves. Also, this thing's turret rotation speed is abysmal. We can fight that, so we're not going to. We'll send that man to the gulag. For his sins. Right, KV1B. That's it. That'll do. Uh, I can't really chase that because this guy's here now too, right? That dude that is behind this building right now is going to be pretty angry, I would say, that that guy never noticed. We got him scouted there. Oh, we are so lucky. <laughs> we are so lucky. Our speed got us out of that. I'm not sure. This guy got his turret back. Just got hit again, I think. I'm not sure who by. Right, I'm quite happy with the havoc that we've caused over here, for sure. I would like to see the... Arrow is the name of the guy that hit us. And he might be on his way over here, unless it was just artillery. Where's Arrow? Oh wait, Arrow 1 is my teammate. So actually my teammate was the one that hurt me. Where are you going? Little stug. Well, we knocked this cannon breach out, so... He can't shoot us. But if he's got friends, then... He's dead too. Things are going exceptionally well for us right now. When you can practically solo... Is that a verbal wind back there? If you can solo a, a flag, a, that's... You've really, really helped your team out something else. My man's... Oh, it is a wormy wind. He just got down off the top of the hill. I'm actually gonna drop Artie here, but I think this Crusader might kill him. It might not be... Okay, we have my Artie. It might not be a good idea to chase a wormy wind in this thing. The enemy got B, which I think is the KV-1B that did that. Right? We can't even... Unless I get his turret neck, we can't do anything about it. That guy's stuck on the ice now. He can't get back up from there. The Crusader's chasing him too. Right, please. Right, we're most... Yeah, it's a KV-1. A little too... We pen them. Yeah, a little too high though. Yes! Right, he's coming back in a HE 219 or something. Oh god, there's two guys watching me, I think. I just fired. So we're gonna hit the other one. Gunner and breaches out on him. GG out. Oh, we got the other one. Right, seven kills though. That's a lucky number. That's the stuff. That's what we want. So we got our first task done already, right? The first one is done. Well, the the one for getting at least, I think it's it's four or six kills. I think it's four. One dude pushing the ACAP, he just got bombed, but he's still alive. This medium tank is shooting this dude, which is the Calliope. Yeah, let's watch this chaos unfold right now. Get him, dude. <laughs> Get him, dude. I see you. The Sherman, is it? Bombs away. I probably won't kill him, but I just want the assist at least. Never mind. We absolutely roasted him. And there's a wibble wind up now too. Medium tank just got shot from this. Oh, there's two. Chaffee. And then this guy. Very <coughs> right, good. Yoinkton. This thing is so powerful, by the way. Such a powerful little plane. Right, we are... We are uh, set up pretty nice right now, anyway. Oh, this, this one guy is getting a... Absolute pounding. Our arrow one dude is like flanked all the way around here. Oh, just put M10. I'm coming, buddy. I'm trying. Oh, a teammate's on him too. Ouch. He just got shot pretty hard by that. Can't tell you. 
Right, that guy's breaches out anyway, so he's not going to kill our teammate. Not easily, anyway. My, my fuselage is damaged. Ouch. So, you're a very good shot, dude. For some reason, Chinese players in that M16 variant that they have, they're very, very good at aiming somehow. Chinese SVA players are very, very good at what they do. Bombs out, and we're on the plane. I think my bomb missed the mark quite bad. At least it's, they can fly though. <laughs> Always astounding in tanks. They just seem to shoot you two kilometers through every tree in the game. That, that, that wreckage almost fell in this thing. But for some reason they just can't fly an airplane. That wonderful staring intently at me. Get away. I have to say, by the way, that the smoke does look better, like this, like blowing in the wind. I just wish it wasn't as intense as it is, but there you go. And have your cake and eat it. There we got the wormy boy, and we're going down. It's his ma time. I think we did it, though. I think we got and did it, dude. We are, we're bleeding them out of tickets anyway. I think as well we got four kills in the plane too, right? So that's us. In one match. Where are you at? I hear you, but I don't see you. Oh, yeah. Oh, brother. Another M16. How about that, dude? How about that? Now we yonked him. The 109's come in for another go at me. It's a good thing we got a rear gunner. I want him to catch me. He got his engine, I think. No, he ripped a wing off him. It's a good job this plane uh, doesn't really care about getting damaged, but there you go, that's GG. Yo, nice. 14 kills. Easy peasy. <laughs> right, well, we are uh, on one of my least favorite maps. We are against USA and Germany, which is a very dangerous combination. If there's any nation I would rather not fight, I think in the BT-7, it's going to be USA. If we even pick up one or two kills here, I'll, I'll be pretty pleased. Uh, just so we can get up on our plane and do maximum amount of damage. What on earth is that? It's a flag bus. I'm actually going to drop Ardy on him and move up this side. I'm not confident enough we'll actually do enough damage to make sure he can't shoot us. But artillery might get him a one shot. Right, that, that's a big kill. Breach, please. No breach. He's in strafe, though. Okay, good stuff. That's what we want. Right, two heavy tanks. I'm willing to bet they're KV-1Bs. Both of them. No, that's... Actually, do you know what we... Holy moly. Where did you come from? Thanks for making things easy for me, though. Right. You... Oh, it's a friendly there. I'm fighting this Churchill, yeah? I'm gonna help this KB repair. He might die, though, which is a problem. That's a big bomb. And there's no buildings left here either. Right, KV-1. She's all yours, dude. It's absolute chaos right now. We don't have very many people around the B-gap anymore. I just saw that guy scoot across here. Do you know what? That's a bomb for us. Okay, we... We're all right. He knew I was here. He's absolute numpty. Little KV2. Right. This is very fortunate. Right. 
Ricochet. That's not what I wanted to happen. Right, he killed my gunner and not my loader, so we can get another shell loader. But he, he thinks I'm dead, right? What? Yeah, he was very focused on killing me. Right, 20 seconds to repair. That's an awful long time just for a turret ring, but... That guy almost bombed us on Churchill. We're going to do a bit of a... Uh, reinforcement cutting off. But at least try, right? I was hearing shit over there. This is Stug. Where is he? Right, you, you were a real pain in our team's neck. Uh, this, by the way, this dude in the Chaffee, massive brain. Putting pressure on the Sika, huge brain. That thing has no turret rotation speed at all. Okay, we got we got a single crew member out of them. The the fact I don't have a loader right now is a real pain in the backside. But it's not a deal breaker. I know this stim panzer's now looking for me too, right? He's just chilling on the sea cap though. Right. Good. Ah. This is going pretty well. As long as we get that Churchill dead. We're getting so lucky with these enemies getting desperate to get back into the battle here. I think this guy's race car in two, is he? Nope, he's just chilling here. And he's noticed his mistake. Right, we're definitely gonna die here now. Unless a teammate comes by and a plane and helps us out. I think they do need to try and kill me though, the planes. What was it? Pilot car that scraped me. Here he comes again. Right, it's a 410. ITP. That's going to be a choice. ITP is going to be a choice. Let's go. Is that IL2 being chased? Yes, he is. This 410's got a skin on. I wonder if I can ping him with a 37 from back here. Oh, two of them. That is a very scary aircraft. That's it. Yag 1B. Not only is he fast, he's very maneuverable. Luckily, I got his pilot. Right, the 410 is going out this way. The problem I have, though, is there's a verbal wind up. And I just killed another German with a plane, so it means there's another one coming too. I'm coming, Panzer N. God damn it. I'm sorry, brother. That happens, it does. Keep these guys off our team for now. Get rid of this dude, too. Wait, no tail. The other guy's firing at me. Those dudes are going to take a little while to get over there. Oh, hopefully, this chappy spots this dude. A little stug. Moving through the middle. This is a this is a fight, dude. This is it. This is what I've wanted all day. My heartbeat racing. Okay. That's a breach and I think that they get his mobility too. Chavi's on someone else. This guy's angry with me. I did not get his engine, but we're about to hopefully knock him out here. Roger, roger, roger. Good stuff. I didn't think it was that bad a shot, but yeah, so far, I think he's... Didn't even get the key 61. Right, good. That's more opportunity for us to grab more land. Someone on B. 
Please be German. Give this dude everything we go, right? Okay. No turret crew. We're getting C. The T-34 is creeping on him. Yes. Awesome. Love to see it, dude. Uh, I got his gunner too. <laughs> I got his gunner too. God, they are, they are putting a hell of a fight up, by the way. I need to keep this ARL alive. Right, there goes one Wurble. I don't know how many there are. Oh, a German Sherman. I need to find him. Should get that dicker with that bomb too, just by proximity. Yeah. And we got a plane coming in, which I believe is a Wurble. We'll get rid of this bomb first. The ARL needs help, I think. We'll do another Wurble shortly. Give you one B. That warrants a 500 kilo. Please, both of them drive out. Give you one B just got nuked. Come on, big boy. How did I kill the NATO? Did I'm so sorry, brother. I'm so sorry. I thought I was buying the wall. I think I'm just playing. Survived. Well, the wrong thing and turn into him. It's a 410. He might pancake. Yeah, he did. Yes, he pancaked. Dad, I'm so sorry. I was thinking so much about saving you that I didn't stop to think whether I should. Stop that KV-2 from getting over there. God damn it. That's a HE-219. He got me and I didn't get him, which is really bad. That thing still being alive. Paid me to kill that guy too, he was so close to the cat. Right, KV2. Two guys, three guys moving through. Is that another Sherman down there? Another German Sherman. Alright, and force today, dude. Bringing out the big guns. It's gonna have to be another bomb. I think it's strange he's not using his 50. I can get a bomb off there. The German Sherman just deleted my friend. I should just cannon this Stug. The start. Please. 100 kilo, please. I missed. I had the building. What if I get his engine first? Yeah, we really do need the A point. Okay. We yanked him with the cannons. Come on, ITP. Bro, why does this thing compress? As soon as you... It's weird. It flies fine, but then when you get close to the ground, it gets sucked in. It just gets sucked in. Let's go. Another plane. We just keep going. There with the, our team need our help. It's a KV-2 down there. Our team need to ignore that KV-2 and get to this B-cap. The Tismas pullout game is better. Okay, T-34 on B. Come on, dude. this has been a fight and a half. I see you. And 
A lucky ammo rag. That's a verbal. That's a verbal. No, it's not. Look at my tail control. Just gone. Just like that. That's a verbal. Need to not drop out of the sky too fast. 19 died. And that's game. Oh my god, dude. That was a fight and a half. Holy. Right. That's Alaska. Let's go, dude. We're gonna do some... Not really a flank, but just stop people cabin A, hopefully. Hey, only Germany. There's gonna be at least four KV-1Bs. Do you know that thing has a 6KD globally? KV-1B. 6KD global. Not just one player. Every player that's played it. It has a 6KD between everyone that owns one. That is astonishing. To give you an idea what it's like, the Churchill Mark III has a 1.2 KD. And it's 4.3. This is what you want to see, right? Not a great shot. Well, it was actually a good shot, it's just that it didn't do very much post-spin damage. I didn't think we'd get that guy, but uh, at least wanted to get a shot on him. No. Nope. Something else fired at me. Oh, hey. Chief. Is there another one shooting me too? The other one might peek out, hopefully. So, three Panzer fours. So far. I haven't seen a Puma rush out this way. I'm very likely going to get a Puma coming now though, right? The guy must be repairing. Oh, here. Hey, <laughs> numpty. You forgot you had a couple of, didn't you? I wonder if that other guy we crit will come down here. I got a guy pushing up under the cap though. And he might actually see this guy. Which would be very nice, because uh, otherwise we're just going to have a stair... Oh no. We're just have a steering contest. You're a different story, dude. You're a different story. I think it's going to be very difficult to get me out of here, even for that guy. Right. Another stu is coming. I don't mind... Oh, the other Panzer IV died. Right, that hitbox on there was terrible, right? Okay. The other Panzer probably scouted, unfortunately, has killed our teammate. Is that bomb out for him? Was. Unfortunately, it was unsuccessful. Uh oh. My shot. My shot clipped, and so it is. There's a driver. Okay, knocked him out. This guy is no loader. Right, good. And I think that's stupid. I'm gonna. If I die, we die. We've we've done enough damage here. Literally held off every. Oh, we're packers, and we've held off every stug and Panzer IV have thrown at us so far. We gotta get a cat, help our team out a little bit. Um. We got a, a friendly there, another Sherman. I'm also tracking that guy through all those buildings. 
what I'm most worried about is one of those guys that we killed that's going to bring an anti air in. This guy really wants to bomb me though. Lucky bud. His 20 mil can still damage me depending on his belt. There's no way you're like this. There he is. Yep. Okay. Oh, it's a murder. Panzer 4 H just killed another teammate here. I think I can in battle. Look at that murder doesn't get the scout. This Panzer 4 H is over this side. I think it marked on the map here, unfortunately, but it is what it is. I think Bridget make something stojan. What on earth is that? Turn your hull! That's not the guy. What happened to that round, though? I'm still firing APAG. Crap. Is it just a little bit of lag? There's an enemy here too, you know? No, no. Friendly. Enemy down there, though. I'm far away. That's two. And here, here comes the... The Reaper, dude. Here comes the Reaper. This guy's scouting up. Oh, nice. Well done. Is my breach red or what? Nope. We weren't gonna get away from going forwards or reverse. I couldn't. I couldn't. Uh... He. I think he hit my roof the first shot. Right. It's this Marty. Let's go. I see the. I see the anti here. <clears throat> Actually, a couple of them. In fact, I think that's a flak 88. We'll come back in the ITP when there's a little bit less anti-air up <clears throat> and I can breathe. You sorry about that, I've still got a lot of fluid in my lung. P47's gonna yeet this guy, hopefully. Come on, big man. There we go. Oh, the P82 actually got him. I think that's it over though. Oh, I hear a sticker. That's what stickers do. I had very little crew left. I think there was another 15mm SPA shooting there, no? I've honestly no idea. Oh, that's GG. Well, there you go. <laughs> so it's pretty clear that this little guy is a fantastic little tank. It's just a shame that it's been locked away as an event vehicle. I think Russia could definitely do with having a light tank running about this BR uh, that's got scouting. Uh, I'd like to see more of these little guys. They're very fun to play. I don't think they're very overpowered. And I think it's a very fair BR for this thing. It's just, no one really has one. Speaking of overpowered though, and this guy and this guy. Yep, this is extremely cheap right now. And it's probably your last chance to get one under $10 before the Christmas sale. Uh, so if you're looking for a cast plane for Russia, that will do you probably to about 5.7. Yeah, get one. I'd also like to put another plug for the Discord. There's about 20 voice channels right now filled with people who are squatted up to grind the events. It's the best way to do it, so make sure you get your button here and uh, make some new friends. There's 9,000 members now. It's one of the most active Discords I've ever seen, and that's uh, all thanks to all the Patreons and Discord Premium members who help us support that. Uh, all the tier 3 people who get a shout out from Discord as well, that's Illustrious, Toby Boy, Blue Bayou, Shadow Wolf, Stoyan, Olympic Chimnist, and to all the tier 3 patrons and all the patrons over there too.
That is Milka the Tactical Broccoli, Matthew S, Jesse Mills, the Taco Guy, Toast McGee, Anders Stormer, Brahma Nation, Sexy, Ethan, Excavation Nation, Gifted Greed, Handsome Tortilla, Ken the Salt Lord, Kino Sobasa, Lord Draven, Ralph, Rage, Tectonic, The Fire Paper, Reformation, Trash Panda, Varian, Warpig, Zema, Yorkbo, Shaf, Mortanen, Stoyan, two people, that's two people that are tier 3 in two platforms, crazy. Jay Tormey, Mr. Buzzwell, Shmoo, and Stuart Netherton. We've also got five days left of our a uh, seven days of Bosmus. You might win a prize over there if you're active in the Discord. So hopefully I'll see you there. And as always, thank you guys very much for watching. Much love. And bye bye, Yiga. I mean, bye bye.